Oh, whoa, whoa. Good, bro? Whoa, whoa. You, you, you okay? Whoa. Damn. I don't know if it upsets me more that it's staged or makes it better. So why is the dude wearing a hat that still has a tag on it? And why is that woman in the background dancing like a stripper on Grand Theft Auto? But more importantly, why does this even exist? This video has over 207 million views. This is, what, what are we doing? Like entertainers, content creators of the internet and the world, what the fuck are we doing? Why are we wasting our time trying to come up with good content and videos? Why are we perfecting our craft? We could literally just assault strangers at the grocery store. Ah, oh, my pumpkin! My pumpkin! My pumpkin! My pumpkin! Bro! My pumpkin! This is all of our fault. Sometimes I'm just disappointed in the internet. Look, I, I want everybody to know that if my comedy doesn't take off the way that I would like it to, January 1st, 2023, I promise you, I am going to be doing this. Yeah, I'm giving up, that's, that's it. I get one year to get my stuff together, and then by 2023, I'm going to be assaulting people in grocery stores and just recording it. I mean, if this guy can get away with it, imagine, imagine what a white man can get away with. This upsets you too, right? Like you watching this, do you get mad that this exists on the internet? This man has over 20 million followers and all he does is ruin people's day. I'm sorry, pretend to ruin people's day because none of these videos look real. Like he would have at least got shoved there. Like maybe the dude at this Walmart didn't want to just punch a stranger today. I understand if maybe he's got his anger in check and he didn't want to assault him, but you mean to tell me he's not giving him just a, just a little shove? This dude's probably going to be in movies because of this. People only care about followers. Clubs are probably going to book him too. There's going to be comedy clubs. They're going to book this guy and audiences are going to pay money to see him talk about throwing boxes over people's heads. I, I don't even know. Come 2023, that's what I'm doing. I'm just gonna be a nuisance. I'm just gonna disrupt everything that happens in public. Yeah, you, you, you watching this video, you're not safe. If I don't accomplish the things in my career that I set out to in 2022, I might throw a box over your head in a Walmart. It might happen. If you don't want it to happen, help me out. Ah, oh, my pumpkin, my pumpkin, my pumpkin. Me pumpkin. Bro. 